guys, welcome to today's video. Today is T minus two days until show and we're headed to the barn. We have like a bunch of show stuff to do and um, we made so many changes. I don't know if I should tell you or if I should do a big huge plot twist at the show. Like it's exciting, like it's gonna be fun. Like even I am excited for this year. I'm excited, I'm excited, like I'm more excited for this year than ever before. I'm not even gonna lie. I'm I'm so excited. Like, things have changed. We ride at a lesson bar now. I'm just excited. I'm excited if it doesn't rain, for sure. Are you excited to make sure it doesn't rain? Mm -mm. Gabby went out with Kaylee last night. Didn't have much sleep, so we're gonna see how today goes. But first, we have to pick up all the stuff you need for horses. We need grain and we need beet pulp. So and, let's go. Um, I brought this for Tan. Yeah. So I mentioned in yesterday's video that we had our massage girl come and massage Chance and she said that he's a tiny bit tight in the back end and that our chiropractor will be able to fix that right up. So we called her and we're waiting for dates for her. So she's just, Sophie's just gonna play with him today. We're just doing like light walk riding right now until he improves his weight and until walk we get, trot. yeah, walk trot until she improves his weight until he, we improve his weight, he's doing really good with his weight. He's out on grass yesterday, and um, we're kind of waiting for her to come and adjust him and make him all perfect. Our massage therapist says we're going to have a whole new horse after the, the chiropractor comes. I'm a bit worried about that, but we're going to see. We're going to see what happens. So, it's working. You just walked by your horse and didn't even see him? I saw him. Oh. Sophie and I are talking away about it. Yeah, there's a new pony. So the little wagon that I got works so good. I guess that must be the beet pulp that we have left. It's this stuff that's heavy. Whoa. Ow. I can't film and carry stuff. So Chino's moved to that pasture again. Gabby and Sophie's horses swapped fields. Because, My horse is um, so that, because Chance is going to do <laughs> well on you. grass. You're <laughs> so cute. You don't move on the horse. <laughs> okay. We have to try and get through all these horses. And then, there is a cow leaving the property, and he's on the trailer, or else or maybe he's there. just coming. I don't know. Okay. Um, I don't oh my gosh. Exactly this is not a good field for Sophie and Debbie. I. Gabby. Gabby. <laughs> Chance. Come here, Chance! <laughs> Chance pants! <laughs> All right, I'm gonna put you guys down. We're gonna go get Sylvie's horse. He, there's three chestnuts in this field now, and Chance might be dirty. No, oh, thank goodness. He's not the dirty one. Oh, he's on the wrong side of the fence. All right, uh-oh, okay. I was outside, he was inside. <laughs> oh, hello, baby. This is the baby. <laughs> it's the foal that jumped the fence before. She never did it again. So Chino is gonna be staying in at this barn tomorrow night so that he's in after his bath. All right, I gotta go. There's, like I said, there's, uh, it's gonna be crazy. There is a cow on a trailer. We have to walk past it with Chance. And it is making a lot of noise on that trailer. Not yeah, so Chino is. Oh, he's upset because he's alone. He's upset because of the field change. And Sophie can't get her horse by the trailer. All in a day's life of horses, you guys. <laughs> Are you mad? <laughs> yeah, keep all doors closed. Wow, he's gonna. <laughs> yeah. Don't, yeah. Keep all the doors closed, okay. he won't run you over. All right, don't run me over. First show of the season and already things are falling apart. Holy moly, they are like, he is. He is not loving this change of field. Whoa! Whoa! This is why. Wow! Have you guys ever seen him have this much energy before? Chino! Stop! He's traumatized by the move. Holy heck. I want to go, I want to watch and see how they get chance. This is a bad day. <laughs> this is such a bad day. Chino, listen, I need to I need the window. Get. Go. So if I didn't make myself clear.
there's a cow on a trailer. There's a cow on a trailer over there and it is acting like it wants off the trailer and it is running and making so much noise. And I didn't want Sophie bringing him past because I don't want either of them to have like a bad experience. So I sent Gabby to go bring him past and he's noticing it. Oh God, what the heck? No, he's doing fine. I saw him turn his head quick and look at that trailer. <laughs> so we could have done it. But I wanted to make sure that they both had a good experience. So good. He did good. Here comes your friend, Gino. Oh, he always stops there. Like that trailer's been there. That tractor's been there every single time. There we go. He likes to stop, look around, and then move forward. There you go. Look out the window. Whoa! He won't run you down, she says. He tries to run me down. He's looking good. Don't you even think about it. Your friend is coming. This is the last time I babysit a crazy horse. Okay, yeah, away from me. She's gonna have to let him run this out. You better have energy for the show. Good luck. <laughs> you told me he wouldn't try and run me down, tries to run me down. Get out of my face. Well, I'm not in love with that. That's not my favorite thing. That's what I do. So he didn't even need me. No, he did really good. I know, I just didn't want them to have a bad experience. All right, so there's a rule that no horses go past that pole on the ground. Chino just disobeyed all the rules. So the reason that we have moved Chino's field is because we don't want him on a round bale. We want one horse on a round bale. We want one horse off a round bale. Like, with horses, it's never ending. Like, there's always stuff. You don't ever just get, like, when I was growing up, I saw horses in fields. I thought they just lived there. You never did anything. You just filled their water, left them. That's not true. You don't like it. <laughs> don't you come here. I'm going to bring in Finn and put him next to him. Okay. So, he so. So we brought in a ball. I just threw it and mashed it. I didn't even hear. So we brought in a ball to play with chance. He's interested. He's just not. Yeah, he's just not energetic. Oh, look, he's going to hit it. No. Nope. He did it. <laughs> thoroughbred you guys and crazy is not my word that's other people's words
Então. Get it. <laughs> He's like, I'll just come to you instead. Yeah, you're such a good boy. All right, so today is a disaster because we are trying to get Chino off around Bale. He's not in love with the idea because he's in love with one of the horses in his old field. And so now he's separated by her from her. It's a, it's a girl and he loves her and he doesn't want to be be separated by her so he pulled a shoe running around like a crazy person well so we're gonna put the shoe back on but the problem is if we don't like fix his issue being separated from his friend then he's just gonna keep pulling shoes because he runs around like crazy as you guys saw so we're gonna get the girl and we're gonna put her in the field with him so that he'll be calm is it pouring so we brought Finn in so he could see Finn and be with Finn. And then... As you guys saw, Chance did not care about the ball. Yeah, Chance... I'm kind of surprised. <laughs> yeah, Chance is such a good horse, you guys. Penny loves like, pushing balls and she doesn't even like when oh. they get pushed too hard. And Chance, Chance likes it. So if he was pushing the Chance ball to like, him... Can you just pay attention to me? So, uh, so also, other things to tell you guys is that... It looks like you're in jail. So also... Actually, looks like you're in jail. So... It gets more complicated because now Chance is in love with the other girl. So Finny's going back out. And I know he's your friend. We're getting you your girlfriend. You should be happy. He's like, give me him back. <laughs> Hold on, we're getting you a friend. Don't you worry. Chance is calmer than Chino right now. Yeah, everybody's calmer than Chino right now. The calm boy is not so calm. <laughs> he just snotted all over my face. Chino, it's okay. Hey, it's okay. Holy moly. That, like, now he's got energy. Okay. That's Chino for the show. Yeah, wait, this is the Chino we need for the show. He's just losing his mind. Stop. So anyway, so now Chance also is in love with the girl in the field. It's an old horse that nobody even ever like rides or anything. She's just really old and retired and they all love her. So uh, Chance apparently has been chasing all the other horses away from this girl. Chino. He's been uh, chasing all the other girls away from this horse, trying to keep her for himself. And uh, the girl who lives here said that he uh, runs across the field, stands between them and then stops. Runs back across the field, stands between them, and then stops. But the girl apparently likes another horse that's in the field. So it's just this big love triangle. Big horsey love triangle. Chino, unfortunately, is handling it badly. It's okay. We're going to get you fixed up. I heard you're in love with another girl. I heard you're in love with a girl. But did you guys see him? Like, you see how he's so slow? So I even asked the girl who lives here. She watches him in the field, and I'm like... So it, does he like move in the field? Does he run? She said, yeah, like he runs to keep the horses away from his girl. <laughs> he runs across the field and then he stops. And because even like, remember I told you guys before he's like storm, like he moves like this slow all the time. Like nothing is alarming to him. And, and long ago, my friend told me that Storm isn't slow, he just knows when to conserve his energy and when to spend it. So I hope, hopefully that's what Chance is like and he seems to be like that. Like he has moves and he can go. The girl that lives here said that he's actually quite fast when he gets going. Okay, so we're headed home now. Oh man, you guys, the stuff we've just seen. I don't have my camera with me. I'm like, oh, where's my camera? So basically we put the mare in with Chino. He's happy. He's such a happy boy. He's like nuzzling up to her and he's so happy. He was bragging to Chino. He was bragging. Unfortunately, all the boys that are in the adjacent field, like keep in mind, Chino is never alone. He's just in like adjacent to all the other horses. So all the other horses freaking out that Holly's gone. Holly, Holly, everybody loves Holly. So 
so uh, we went to watch and make sure everything was okay because you can't just throw horses around and leave them. So we're all out there watching and Rhett, you know, the two chestnuts, Chance and Rhett, who used to be in the field that Chino's in now, they're in the further field. Chino and them switched fields. So they're all staring at each other. Chino's got his girl by his side and he's covering her up and blocking their view of her and their like ears are perked forward and then all of a sudden, Rhett and Chance are racing back and forth across the field. Like, he's such a slow horse and a lazy horse in the arena. Like, anywhere you take him, he's so quiet and so laid back. But when he sees his girl, sees his girl across the paddock and she's with another man. Oh man, he was doing laps. Phew, phew, to the water trough, back again, to the water trough, and he we're just so watching him. Yeah, him. like, we're just watching him. Like, he's so pretty. Like, he moves so nice. And yeah, so yeah, everything's fine now. The pastures are quiet. We watched because we thought for sure they were gonna try and jump the fence, but it's like literally the two laziest horses on the farm. So we're hoping that they won't. <laughs> Anyway, if the girl Chance ever gets a burst of energy, he will jump it. Yeah, like so they're they're all settled down now. Oh man, we have a lot of plans. But doesn't it always seem like the day before a horse or the the just before a horse show everything just like falls apart and there's so much chaos and you get worried about all these things and then in the end it just comes together and you get to the show and it's all good. And he's happy now. He's just following her around. Does he's got his head right up against her butt. Yeah, poor horse. Thank God for Holly. Don't you know that you're beautiful?